Recently, Tesla's AI4 or Harder 4 car got the FSD version 13. It got the capability of reversing the car if it need to for various situations. But for Hardware 3 vehicle, we don't have it. But we're gonna test few narrow roads, unprotected left turn, and also some constructions on areas where AI3 will have some hard time. So let's check it out. Hey everyone, we are back with another full self-driving video version 12.5.4.2 in Hardware 3 or AI3 vehicle. We definitely doesn't have version 13 because it's only available for Hardware 4 or AI4 vehicles. So as you guys can see, there are construction going on in this upcoming stop sign. What we're gonna do is we're gonna merge and we need to definitely follow that Honda Accord in front of us because it's probably gonna go and make that merging lane. So let's see how the car handles. As you guys can see, we are going at the very last moment, we're changing the lane and we came into this lane perfectly. It was smooth. Previously, when I was making videos, like even if like in yesterday, when I was making that video, the car changed the lane at the very last moment and saw that vehicle at the very last moment and brakes a little hard. So we stopped for this stop sign, but I definitely felt like the car stopped a little less. Like it should have stopped for like two or three seconds. But the car stops probably just one second and when there is no other vehicle the car proceeds so this is one thing i just want to mention also guys if you guys are new in the channel i request you please hit that subscribe button because i'm a new content creator and i, I would love to get new subscribers who love fsd videos who love tesla and stuff like that so we are making this left turn and then i'm gonna change the route to test that narrow road so let's do it guys so narrow road test number one in new york as you guys can see we are proceeding we're gonna make a left turn in this narrow road right now so we are going the car is going a little fast and immediately making this left turn there is no other vehicle and we make this left turn looks easy very good definitely a little cautious like while making this left turn it seems like the car is calculating the space between left side and right side it is making a space while making this left turn but the good thing is previously exactly in this location the car always gets stuck but this time the car didn't stuck which is a very good thing to do right guys so we are gonna do that test one more time because i want to see how the car handles this exact narrow road one more time so let's do it guys narrow test number two in new york with the hardware 3 or ai3 vehicle version 12.5.4.2 and we're making a left turn on this narrow road as you guys can see the car is coming a little fast and then realize that we're going to make a left turn and slows down but again this time the car was able to make this left turn while the other time exactly same version the car fails so many times so very impressive right guys because this is the thing i was talking about like in previous uh software version or even if like this software version the car always fails to navigate us uh through this uh, narrow road i i really don't know why it is should be it should be like very easy to make a left turn in narrow roads like because you can if you can see everything clearly you can definitely make a left turn or right turn in narrow roads but the car was hesitating earlier so we had to test this kind of thing so the road is closed as you can see and i don't know uh, okay that person was saying that person was saying that person was saying to go from a different road and we're gonna see how the car handles this situation i'm just gonna test this and we're stuck again the person was coming so we're gonna make a left turn here because the road is closed we are gonna uh do and make a left turn here because the road is closed and the car couldn't calculate that per, per that person was showing us to go uh make a left turn and go and reroute but the car couldn't do it it was just stuck so i had to take over uh definitely not a critical disengagement but it is a disengagement that the car if the car knows like okay let's just make a left turn and let's see how the car how i can like you know like navigate us through this situation the car decided just to stack over there so i took over i don't want to like you know like bother people while driving and stuff like that so uh we're gonna make 
a right turn here and then we're gonna do some unprotected left turn guys so let's do it so unprotected left number one in new york this is a tricky unprotected left if you are familiar with my channel you know what i'm talking about this is a tricky unprotected left where you need to stop on this stop sign then creep a little bit to look on your left side and if there is no other vehicle you should just go straight and make a right and immediately make a u-turn but uh, let's see how the car handles this unprotected left so we stop for this stop sign there is no other vehicle we can definitely proceed and it is going it is going and uh, no yep it just missed that u-turn and now it is making a u-turn from here and there is a vehicle so i'm just gonna take over i'm just gonna take over because there is a vehicle and i had to take over and there are other cars coming from the opposite side so uh, this is what i don't like like you should just make that u-turn from the first lane you should just come to that left turn lane wait over there for the opposite side traffic and just make a u-turn from there but what you did was coming and then you know didn't even um wait on that left turn and then um miss that block went to the next block and then make trying to make a u-turn while there is a car coming from our behind and i had to take over because there is no space to stop there right so let's do it one more time guys unprotected left number two in new york hardware three vehicle version 2.5.4.2 .2, and let's find out how fsd handles this tricky unprotected left turn this is definitely a tricky unprotected left because you need to stop here behind the stop sign and then look on your left side if there is no other vehicle you should go straight and stop and make a right turn there is no other vehicle immediately make that right turn there is no way you can do it right now you can do from that next block as you can see very slow and uh, going and making this u-turn so it missed that first block like the last time and then it chose the next block to make this u-turn so i'm not a very big fan of this kind of situation i prefer you go straight make a right turn stop there on that left turn lane and if there is no other vehicle from the opposite side or opposite side traffic and then you can make this u-turn so you just missed that first block and went to the second block to make this u-turn which i really don't like so let's do it one more time guys unprotected left number three in new york hardware three vehicle version 12.5.4.2 .2. let's find out how the car handles this unprotected tricky left turn as you can see we are proceeding and hopefully the car will be able to do this time there are traffic this time on the left side so let's find out how the car handles so you should creep a little bit stop there and then when there is no other vehicle you can just proceed yep after this again okay this time probably it will go oh okay very fast again very fast again miss that block and coming here and making this u-turn from here not a big issue definitely it missed that first block but the, it did it perfectly that's the main thing i want to mention there that the car could just easily like easily go straight and make a right turn and then make a u-turn so let me just show you how i was how i was thinking the car will do so it came out from this block and then it should just come here wait for this opposite side traffic and when it's safe you can just make this left turn from here or make a u-turn from here right guys so hope you like this video guys if you did please make sure you hit that subscribe button because as i told you i'm a new content creator i'd love to hear from you please let me know in the comment what you think about this performance too and i'm just gonna end this video here hopefully you like this video please give this video a like and hit that subscribe button thank you for watching guys i love you so much and have a wonderful wonderful day